tell them uh, what you did. Wait, how you get started on that? Alright, so you can get into. So you say you won't do it in high school. Yeah, you right, you right. Alright, so with this acting shit, no bullshit, bro. Like this shit just came out the blue, bro. Like I said, I was playing college football for the Division Two jump. So then. One day, bro, I came home and shit for one to break. You know how niggas always come home and break and shit, me on bullshit. So I'm fucking with some bitch. Bro, this bitch got me locked up. Oh, God. Like, it's a real shit. Bro. Yeah, she called some nigga to my crib and shit, like all types of wild shit. And got down, basically, I had four felonies, bro. I had brandishing a firearm. I had uh, damage in the phone line to authorities. I had a grand larceny um, charge, and I had malicious wound. Them oh, all four felonies. Oh had. man, you was I going out. I that shit to the dome. I swear to God. You going out like Mad Max. Bro, I ain't even do shit. She just like, I ain't ready to spill that shit on the air, but y'all know what I'm saying? That shit closed case anyway. Just don't call nobody to my crib, you know what I mean? But the whole time, nigga, I ain't got no felony. Straight spank that whole case, like, you feel me? And then, even after that situation, I apologized to Shawty anyway, so I don't really give a fuck about that shit. But that shit made me who I am, bro. Like, I got a tat on me that say freedom, I swear to God. Like, that shit right here. Because, like, nigga, my third day in jail, bro, I got banked in that bitch by some grown-ass man. I ain't even know, bro, I swear to God. God damn. Like, because I had four that nigga on the street and shit, and then it was like... Oh yeah, you such and such that you got my little cousin and shit. And they try to say I shot at bro, but I never shot that nigga damn in my life. Oh god, like try to find with the press. Yeah, so goddamn niggas jumped me and shit. In my third day in that bitch, they had moved me to the mouth. I don't know if y'all niggas ever been locked up in Henrico County and shit. But there's some shit called the mouth that they classify you in if you got all them crazy ass felonies and mm -hmm. shit. So nigga, I'm fucking 18, 19, and that bitch with grown ass man, bro. No bullshit. Yeah. That shit was crazy, bro. I know that drum was tough. So then got done. How long you was in that drum? A month. Oh, shit. Nigga, they was denying That's my long bond. Long Nigga, I was in the hole, bro. I only went to jail once my whole life. That whole month, bro. I went through everything in that bitch, nigga. I was in the hole out of New Kent. I was in the hole at Henrico all the time. Like, then they transferred me on the bus to New Kent. Then they denied all three bonds in general district court, so they had to move that shit to circuit court. So basically, like, nigga, I got out of jail, got kicked out of college. Then some lady that my aunt do hair for, she was like, you know any um black teenagers in the area? She was like, I need some slaves for a movie. And I dead ass had a whole ankle monitor on and some oh, yeah. shit. I swear to God, bro, I'm on like, GPS monitor. Wait, wait, wait. A black lady actually? Who? Some white lady. White my lady. hair do like, my aunt do professional hairstylists and shit. So like she plugged That's in crazy, white bro. people in the West End and shit. Yeah. So it's this lady named Kendall Cooper. She still hired me for all these jumps. Like I'm doing a Kevin Durant movie right so now. So really she's she really she be looking out. Yeah. yeah, no bullshit. So the first jump she put me on with was some slave jump and got them. I straight did that, John. I had an ankle monotone the whole movie, bro. I'm dressed like a slave, though, I swear to God. Like, they putting, like, dirt on my face and everything. So then, I did another movie like that, but I won't fucking with that shit no more, because I really felt like a slave, bro. You feel me? Like, that shit was whack. They was treating niggas trash and some old shit. It's cold as a bitch. I'm really wearing slave clothes. They having niggas carrying yeah, cotton you, you, you in shit. that motherfucker. Yeah, man. bro, this was the Harriet Tubman film. You I mean, in there? Wow. <laughs> but bro, you kind of light though, bro. They with the you supposed to be in the crib. They docking me up, man. They docking you. They, they like, nah, we need you to be a house guard right now. Feel that? Cause I had hair and shit, so they like fuck it. Word, but that nigga feel like. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, was so what her to hooking you up with like these opportunities is like, are you getting a bag from this or like is this more so? I ain't just gonna say to, I'm making like fucking bands. Nah, but, I probably make like. Band. Okay. Very event. You okay. Me? Yeah, that ain't bad though. That yeah, ain't bad. That's, that's, that's like a decent start. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. Like, so I have like how many uh different yeah different uh movies shows you been in? Okay, the next one after the slave jump, I was in goddamn Burning Sands on Netflix. It was this joint with uh Trevor Jackson and the nigga Rotini yeah, from Power. The um. 
Yeah. The joint, it was Dre, like. Dre from Power. Yeah, Dre from Power. Bro, what yeah. was that joint? The, 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 the hazing joint. Yeah, they was doing the hazing yeah. shit. We filmed that joint at Virginia State. You was in the little Bird. fast food joint. Yeah, I was in the fast food scene. Uh, I was in some shit scenes for real, but that was like my cameo joke. What you, what you, what you say in that joke? Shit, nigga, I was just saying, like, they was arguing. What you doing in the fast food joke? Uh -huh. Basically, they was like, man, you gotta throw some emotion in that joke. Something like, alright, so basically. I don't want no fries! Yeah, type shit, but I didn't have to say that. It was just like, damn, like, I was watching the two girls arguing and shit. Yeah. So they was like, I heard you slept with my man last night at the frat party and shit. And she was like, oh, I don't know your man. So then I had to tap the nigga beside me, like, yo, you, you with this shit? Like, no bullshit. I had like, we? look, 10 second clip in that bitch, no bullshit. That's hard. Awesome. Got that on my Instagram page. <laughs> I like, watch them on Netflix, yeah. Oh, yeah, and she posted that joke. Yeah, she did, no bullshit. Then, like, she, um, I posted some shit one day at Jesse Barbershop. It's the, uh, it's in the, what's her name, the festival? The festival, and yeah, yeah, she I, on I, Black Lightning, bro. bro. For real. Yeah, that, that's, that's hard. hard. So then we did that joke. And, like, bro, I swear to God, bro, I smoked gas with this nigga Trevor Jackson. Y'all seen Superfly? Yeah. The main character, that yeah. nigga. And I had to be the stand-in for this nigga. So like a stand-in is like, you gotta resemble the person that you standing in for. Cause like you see how y'all got the camera set up right yeah. now. So basically, if I'm the main character, they'll have a nigga come sit right here while they capture all the angles and shit. And use all the rotating and shit that they gonna use before the actual main character come oh, in. So then they had me doing that for bruh. And I was with these niggas every day, so then the um, director just was like, man, I fuck with Lil' Bro, like, he cool, let's use him on camera. No yeah. bullshit, like, I'm only supposed to be in that. Like, and this was this, the, from um, the Superfly? From the Burnham Yeah, Sanders. that was the nigga from Superfly. Right? But it was the nigga from Superfly. Yeah, that Superfly. shit was great. But yeah, them niggas was cool, bro, no bullshit. Damn, bro, so how long you been acting? Bro, like, two years. No bullshit, like, and I went to an acting workshop with, uh, in Philly for that joint, Nefessa Williams and shit. And she made me do a scene from Love and Basketball, bro. I straight smoked that bitch. I you, swear to God. You, you did your thing? Yeah, it was like I 40. It was like 40 people. I had to do the scene where um, he was telling her, like, when she was talking about going to the prom and shit, the little date shit. He was okay. like, who you going with? And she was like, I don't know such and such. She was like, yeah, you should take Spalding. Cause remember mm -hmm. he was like she was in love with basketball and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, that's hard. But yeah, she made me do that scene and shit with this girl. All right, so so now if it if it came down to it, like rap or act? Shit, I'm a fucking act. It's too many niggas crazy. rapping, bro. You know what's crazy? I'm not mad at that answer, <laughs> bro. Yeah, that, that's, that's too many that niggas, bro. Cause on some shit, the shit I want to do with acting, bro, I want to do what I wanted to do in real life. And it's like, these movies look fucking real. So it's like, if I do a movie playing fucking Division One college football, nigga, I did that shit for real. I play, I play <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, even though I played D2, my goal in life, I always wanted to play Division One college football. You feel me? So yeah. like, if I do a movie like that, So nigga, is there like any roles you wouldn't do? Because you, I knew you said you ain't really fuck with like the slave shit. So you wouldn't like... Any role, I ain't gonna say I wouldn't, but like they had if nigga hit me up right now, like what I got these three roles, which one you don't want? It'll be some shit like Tupac from Juice. I ain't trying to do that shit. Yeah. That shit is too much emotion. That nigga dead ass is tweaking for real. <laughs> dead ass like no bullshit. Like it's, it's, bro, that's that's um that shit took too much emotion out of me. That's bro. That's interesting, bro. For real, bro. I don't. I don't meet too many actors, bro. Me Especially either, bro. Nah, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh yeah, like nah. I mean, I'd have heard about you know niggas around the joint like acting and trying to get into stuff like that. And you was in The Walking Dead. Yeah, hell yeah. You you was a zombie in that joint, bro. So I tried out to be a zombie. Bro. That was Walk. the yeah. That was the first one. Wait, you was you was one of the. So look, I tried out to be a zombie because that's what they told me to come through and doing shit. Mm -hmm. But my zombie walk was so trash. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, nah, you just gotta be a survivor. Like, <laughs> yeah, so they just made me be a survivor on each episode. 
So I ain't talking and shit, but I'm just there, like on every episode. Nigga just hanging in the background. Yeah, bro, just helping them do shit, like scavenge for shit. So I, I'm so I'm we see you, see you probably you. never know. Yeah, facts. Yeah, <laughs> you <laughs> seen me and like, bro, you know what's crazy? Probably go back and rewatch them just now, bro. Like, oh, this nigga look familiar. Oh, bullshit. I was like, bro, that's crazy. Sitting there with my girl, like, bro, I know that. Yeah, no bullshit. This nigga Gucci on the AMC joint. It came out on AMC. The new season, The Walking Dead and shit. And then I when they in like the settlement. Yeah, and I ain't it's never crazy. watched this watch shit. This is crazy, bro. Walking Dead with the black dude. That's crazy. Bro, that's, that's it. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Hey, yo, yo, yo. Make sure y'all uh, tap into that Count Dead live and just send this joint out. Oh, yeah. Y'all want to just tap in. No, bro, no, no, no. To be 100%. I was like, bro, I don't want no more rappers on this joint, bro. I don't want no strippers, nasty bitches, OnlyFans. I ain't gonna oh, no, do that. I look though. You gotta stand up. But, but then, but now meeting you, I'm like, oh, now, nah, brother's not just a rapper, brother's yeah, like multi talented. Now you, you gotta stamp this though for um mm-hmm. for the preview of the clip. I ain't no rapper, bro. Nah. Like, my, my album know that I'm gonna drop, it's gonna be called Art. Because I call mm-hmm. myself an artist. And A R T stand for actor, rapper, trap. Mm-hmm. No bullshit. So that's really what I do. No bullshit. Hey, hey, and bro, like that. it just show how versatile, you, uh, how versatile you, you can be, especially how versatile we can be in the black community, bro. Like, bro, niggas be doing everything, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, niggas, niggas be doing everything. And for real, bro, the, the world we live in now, bro, I told myself that the other day. I was like, bro, it ain't, it ain't enough to just be one thing, bro. You got to be, be everything, for real. But yeah, um, actor, rapper, trap. Yeah. All right, when you plan on dropping that? Yeah. I'm drop. I want to drop that shit right before, like, this year and but I don't want that jump to be like a 2020 album and I can't classify that bitch as the hardest album of 2021, you feel me? Like, so I wanna drop that bitch soon. Shit, I, I, I think you'll be able to do that, but um, I think you'll be able to get away with putting that joint off and dropping this month. For real? I yeah. wanna drop that bitch this month because I've been working mm-hmm. on that joint for a whole year. I mean, tracks on that joint. Eight. Eight. Yeah. So it's, it's a solid eight tracks. Straight elk folk shit. Uh, yeah, I respect that. I respect that. I respect that. So, uh, eight. Music, man. Let's go ahead and talk about music. What's up? So, what made you want to transition? Because you was already. You was, already, you was acting before rap. Hell yeah. So, what made you, like, want to train? Like, so, you just started rapping, like, recently? I mean, I've been rapping with my niggas for, like, two, three years, but. I just started dropping shit dead ass like two years ago. But I only got two songs on album, so it was like, I be taking my so, time with that shit. Alright, so you, you still getting like, yeah, into the like, yeah, shit. Yeah, I'm okay. trying to find my sound. Right, gotcha, gotcha. And yeah. it, it, it ain't nothing wrong with that. Because um, when I went to go check out the shit, I was like, bro, this shit got, this shit got good good reviews on it. People fucking with it. Yeah, really appreciate did. that. And your numbers looking nice too, because um, yeah. But you say you do like the promotion shit and all that shit and that yeah, shit. Yeah, see, like on certain videos I do, but if I make like 1,500 views on the ground by myself without promoting that shit, I just leave it like that. I just, yeah. Because yeah. I be fucking with that shit. I be like, shit. Shit, shit. but the, the yeah. promotion though will take it. Yeah, the promotion will take it up, but then it's be like, we're not really looking you, at it. You like, know, that's the, the real love. Yeah, right that's there. the real love and, right there. Yeah, that's like and, and, and then one thing you own about the numbers on the ground, you know, them jobs. Them jobs artificial anyway, like Some whether no no whether they real or not, because at the end of the day you don't get to keep them jobs. Like if you yeah. put that video in the archive, them numbers don't go with that video. Oh for real? No, you drop that video again, them numbers go back to zero. You feel me? So it ain't like them numbers them numbers yeah. don't even matter. That's that the end of the day. That, you feel me? So it's just like bro, you like them numbers only there for the for the time a video being there. Yeah. So it's, 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 bro, that shit just crazy, bro. So I I had to find that out. <laughs> I dropped something in the archive, trying to get it off. I'm like, oh damn, the numbers gone. <laughs> Shit. I'm like, this ain't the same. I'm just trying to get <laughs> some YouTube money for real. Bruh, who you telling about it? That's yeah. why I be making videos and shit. Like, I want to make a video for every song. Like, I just made a new video for mm-hmm. real and I directed that jump. Yeah, that's how I do. Yeah, that's, that's how I'm how trying to be on that. Nah, it's definitely a bag in YouTube, bro. Yeah, I'm trying to act through my music. You know, bro. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't trying to know. For real, that's what I'm saying. A lot of people, a lot of, a lot of big artists doing that shit now. Too. Now, yeah, they bring like that shit back. You no, know, like acting in their in their music videos. Oh yeah, yeah.